primeiro. Em 1957, Althea Gibson conquistou seu primeiro título Wimbledon um ano depois de ter derrotado a campeã britânica Angela Mortimer nos Jogos de Final da França, tornando-se a primeira jogadora negra vencedora dos quatro campeonatos principais. Em 1958, jogava sua segunda final de Wimbledon. Sua adversária foi novamente Angela Mortimer. A jovem de Torquay, que havia sido treinada por Albert Roberts, o homem que mais tarde produziria Mike Sangster e Sue Barker. Very good lob over her left shoulder. Got the break for Miss Mortimer at 3-2 in the first set. away five games all this gives some breaks back to level the match five games all and now it's set point to miss gibson at seven six oh and a double fault by angela mortimo oh, dear oh dear oh dear what a pity to lose the set that way 8-6 to Miss Gibson, and it's taken, oh, about 42 minutes. And now, two match points against Miss Mortimer. 2-5 down, 15-40 down. Oh. One gone with the wind. 30-40. That's it. Game set and match to Althea Gibson. 8-6, 6-2 in just about an hour and five minutes. So the champion retains her crown. Três anos mais tarde, a perseverança de Angela teve um justo retorno quando, no seu 11 primeiro torneio de Wimbledon, ainda aos 29 anos, venceu uma final dramática contra a favorita de todas as jovens, Christine Truman. Foi seu primeiro home win, desde a segunda vitória de Dorothy Round, em 1937, e a primeira final All-British, desde 1914. One moment with all that underspin and curling spin on the ball, it looked as though it was going to float out. holding her leg really rather badly here. Good. She's in trouble. Remember that Christine Truman had a leg injury back in February? A sudden wrench, maybe. It'll just be all right. I think there's no question that Miss, Miss Truman is slightly Andy, distressed Ms. by the leg.
three championship points for Angela Mortimer. Esta vitória parece que levou as jovens inglesas a acreditarem nas suas próprias qualificações. Pois oito anos mais tarde, em 1969, houve uma outra vitória inglesa quando Ann Jones, que, como Fred Perry, fez nome como jogadora de ping-pong, derrotando a jovem Billie Jean King. log from in there under severe pressure of that deep volley. championship points for Ann Jones. Still championship point. Backhand volleys from the champion has saved her. Net! First service. Advantage, <laughs> Mrs. King. And serve returned even better. Advantage, Mrs. Jones. An extraordinary point. The ball kicked up at Anne's back end. A simple volley missed there by uh, the champion, so it's Championship point for Ann Jones for the third time. Look.
It was an